Hi everyone and welcome to Southern Motors, Michigan's leading muscle and classic car dealer since 1978. Remember, you can always go online and check out our updated inventory at southernmotors.com. Today, guys, are going to take a look at a beautiful 1968 Oldsmobile 442 convertible, real car, guys, factory color combination, and man, just a little sweetheart. This thing rides and drives like it probably did in 68. Uh, just a great car, hits the road good good solid straight body again this is the factory color combination this is provincial white with the parchment interior car only shows 49,000 miles it's supposed to be right and uh, as i always tell people i take miles with a grain of salt there's a lot of little things that i can look at on this car that make me believe it's true um I can't tell you I get a lot of these cars. These are pretty rare. Matter of fact, I haven't even had a chance to actually look up the production numbers on them. But this is a real 442. It's got the matching numbers, 400 engine in it. Factory air convertible. Um, killer set. Of, those are the uh, American Racing uh, billet Magnum 500 wheels on it with the red line radials. Car's got all the original T3 headlights still in it. And again, as we go around, this front bumper is original. Um, a lot of, uh, I think most of the most of this trim is all original for the car. Car was is a, a buddy of mine out of Tennessee is the one that found it for me, and and uh, the guy that he got it from has actually been local to him for a few years. But the car originally came; it's a Z code, so it's original California car. And it is a sweetheart, man. Killer color combination. Sorry, we got bugs out here like crazy today. You can see all the original glass. This is uh, the Easy Eye front uh, shaded front windshield. All the side glass is original. I think they've redone the front seats. I think the back seats original. Carpets original. Uh, new. It's got a, uh, a new boot for it. It's got a new top with the glass rear window in it. Power top functions beautifully. Um, like I say, not a whole lot to really nitpick on this thing. It's, it's not a car that I don't think has been messed with a whole lot. It has had one repaint. Again, you can see a couple little touch-up marks on it but I believe the jams and stuff like that are actually original. Nice and straight down the sides, sits good. Of course, it's got the original uh, cutout rear bumper that the 442s had. This car has the 12-bolt F41 rear suspension with the 308 Posi in it. That's a good looking car right there, man. Yeah, and that's a set of American racing wheels. Those are billet aluminum. 68's got the cool fender stripe there. They just redone the brakes. Um, it's got, um, it's actually got slotted, it's got disc brakes on it with the uh, slotted rotors. Matching numbers, 400 cubic inch engine. I believe these are 325 horse. Um, oh, well, there's why the, I was going to say that when they get inside with the uh, temp gauge doesn't work, the little thing has come unhooked. We'll make sure that gets fixed. Um, 600 CFM, four barrel on, it's got nano Brock intake. They just upgraded it to the HEI billet distributor. Uh, power steering, power front disc brakes, does have factory air, it blows cold. Stock air cleaner. Uh, it has a, uh, you can see it's got a big uh, four row aluminum radiator in it, but it utilizes the factory shroud. 400 turbo hydromatic trans. Really, like I say, hits the road really nicely. Good looking car. That 
Caterpillar Chrome's original, original side mirror. I believe these are all original. Like I say, a lot of this stuff, I think the door pads might be new. You can see the door seams are nice and clean. I think this is the original paint in here. I think the original in the engine compartment too. I meant to show you that. Like I said, I think this stuff is, is new. Uh, original car plate, original seal plates. I've ordered 442 um, mats for it. Factory bucket seats. It's got the center console, the factory stock shifter. Looks like it's got all the correct seat belts in it. It's got the factory tick-tock dash, or yeah, rally dash. The, uh, the tack is not working. They have upgraded it to um, uh, electronic ignition. These would have been points from the factory. You can see it's got the uh, tilt column with a stock sport wheel. You can see a little crack in your steering wheel. Factory dash, I couldn't get the radio to work. Um, wipers, stuff like that, that stuff was working. The AC was blowing cold. It's got uh, dual exhaust. Again, it's got the uh, F41 rear suspension with a 12 bolt, 308 posi. It's got the box control arm the, with the rear sway bar. You can see it's all spackle coated in the trunk. There's a spare in here. Even the trunk light works. Good looking car. Very original underneath. It's not, you know, been a frame off or anything like that. I know that obviously they've upgraded the engine. It's got the hardened valve seats and uh, stuff like that. They put the aluminum intake on it. Again, door seams are clean. Really just a pleasure to drive. Again, it's got the original carpet. It's got a little mark there. Seats are really nice. Very comfortable. Dash pads in great shape. All the gauges were working except for the um, temp gauge, which obviously it's not going to work with the little wire unhook. So we'll make sure that's working. Uh, the tack. It, you'd have to upgrade the tack to get the tack to work because that was it would have been a points driven tack. The eight pillar chrome is really nice. Let's get your air on, air blows cold. Really just a good, good car, man. Put the top down, throw the kids in the back seat, and go get some ice cream. And it's real, not a clone. Probably 90% of the cars I see are clones. And yeah, the oil pressure is good. You can see that. Fuel gauge works. We'll make sure that temp gauge is working. 49,384 on your odometer. And again, the tack is not working. Everything opens and closes nice. The um, top works really nice. Trumpet exhaust tips like it should have. No, I couldn't get that to come on. Blower motor works. And your power top switches up there, it works. And everything opens and closes real nice. T3 headlights, that's pretty cool. Again, guys, make sure you keep track of our inventory. You can do that at southernmotors.com. Another uh, great way to keep in touch with us is our Instagram and our Facebook page, TikTok. Make sure you subscribe to our YouTube page. You can do that by clicking the little button there at the bottom. That way you get a notification every time we post a new video, guys.